Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. How are you, my soleh soleha students? My Allah always protect us from any disease every time and everywhere. Hi, welcome back with Ustaz Zarani. And it means we are going to learn about math again. Ah, before start in the lesson, don't forget to pray first, ya. Pray before study. All right. Uh, first of all, I like to say sorry if um if you watching this video is just a little bit noisy because it's rainy right now when I recording this uh, video. All right, students. Now we are uh, continuing our lesson. So this is the last part of the time uh, section. So the last part on, of the time section, it is about calendar or dice, month, and year. I'm absolutely make sure that you are already learn it also in English maybe or in another uh, subject, but I will uh, tell you also what is calendar in math. So let's start it. Okay, so this is an example of calendar. Calendar tells about the days, weeks, and months of the year. So if you have calendar in your house, it will be shows you about days, weeks, months, is only in a year. Next year or the year before uh, this year, your calendar must be different, right? You can check it out if you are want to check it. And then what is a day basically? So students, the earth spins. We know the earth is Spins. So one time around is one day. That's why uh, every day we finding a day and we find a night because the day at uh, the earth is spins. Like in the picture? Yes. Now, what is a week? So a week is seven days so every seven days is equal to one week remember every seven days is equal to one week now what are the name of the seven days we know that a week consists by seven days so we are going to know right now what are the name of the seven days i'm um, absolutely now uh, you already memorize it but if you are not please try yourself to memorize it at uh, the day of the week the first we have sunday monday Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, uh, Friday, and the last one is Saturday. And the next, we are going to order the days during the week. So Sunday is the first day of the week. Remember, we start it the week in Sunday, or we know it's Ahad, yeah? So we start our day in Ahad, not in Monday, but Sunday. So Monday is the second day of the week. Tuesday is the third day of the week. Wednesday is the fourth day of the week. Thursday is the fifth day of the week. Friday is the sixth day of the week. And the last day is Saturday. So Saturday is the seventh day of the week. So remember it, we start it the week by Sunday. No Monday, yeah, but Sunday. Ahad. Okay.
So what day is it today? So when you learn this uh, lesson, it is absolutely in Monday, yeah? So uh, this is an example, a uh, question when we ask about the day. So the first kind of the question is, what day is it today? So you can say when you le lesson this uh, subject, today is, today is Monday. So what day was it yesterday? Absolutely, after, um sorry absolutely after uh monday it is sunday so uh yesterday was sunday and what day will it be tomorrow tomorrow will be tuesday tuesday yeah remember the difference between tuesday and thursday all right so what day what it is two days ago two days ago so we you can start it it is monday you know it is monday and then it is asked two days ago so the day after monday must be sunday right absolutely and then the day after sunday must be Saturday. So two days ago was Saturday. Okay. Next, what is a month? A month is about 30 days. Remember, if a week is equal to seven days, a month is equal to 30 days yeah how many months are there in year it is about 12 months in a year remember is it 12 months in a year so what is the name of the month ah we have january february march april may june july august september october november and december so this is the order of the month we start it from january february march april may june july august september october november and december all right students so um yeah this is the order of the month yeah february is the first Fe january is the first february is the second and so on and the last month is equal to uh december so december is the 12th month of the year so let's see what kind of the question uh containing about month so what is the first month of the year the first month is january absolutely and then uh, some months have 30 days uh, it is april june september and november and some months also have 30 days it is january march may july august october and december and february is only has 28 or 29 days yeah so uh not all of the month consists by 30 days but some month uh consists by 31 days and the other ones consists by uh february only february consists by 28 or 29 days so what month is it now it is february so to answer it the month is february what was last month last month was january absolutely because the month after february is equal to january what will next month be so after february it must be march so that is an example of the question so students you already learned it about time now uh for solve it uh for more understanding 
please open your uh, worksheet book. Open your worksheet book. So, uh, page 220, a workbook, yeah. Your workbook, page, page. Two hundred and two. Page two hundred and two. So you can do. Let's practice. Number one, stroke number four. All right. So please do this one. So this is your task for today. Page two hundred and two. Number one throw number four so today we only learn about time which is about days and months of the year remember how many months in a year how many days in a month or how many days in a week all right students i think that's all about our lesson today thank you very much for watching this videos and uh, i'm sorry because uh, masjid is already on so uh, i'm sorry for the noisy voices yeah thank you so much see you in the next time assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh